In case you are new here, this channel is all about learning new skills as quickly as possible and documenting the entire progress. I am constantly taking suggestions in the comments or on Twitter, and this one has popped up a couple of times. People have suggested that I learn how to spin a book on my finger, and I looked into this. This is a thing, people do this. This is a skill that is doable. So I'm gonna give it a go. This is day one, our zero. So I want to learn how to spin one of these books on my fingertips for 30 seconds in as short a time as possible. I want to see how quickly I can do this. I can spin a basketball on my finger. I learned how to do that in one of the videos earlier on this channel. If you've not seen it, you should definitely go check it out. I think that that skill will translate well to spin in the book, so this one should be easy. Let's give this a go. So I'm thinking relatively thick books with a little bit of give so the book kind of sags around my finger. Faster. This is a nice Led Zeppelin songbook. I'm not gonna ruin that. Thin and hard. Definitely getting better at spinning the book. But with the book, you kind of have to spin it by moving your hand around it. I, I don't get it. Spinning a basketball is not the same as spinning a book. For a start, the basketball is round, which means it self balances, and I can hit it and add energy, make it spin faster, keep it balanced for longer. With the book, I can't do that. I need to make it spin faster without touching it with my other hand, and I need to figure out how to do that. Check this guy out. This guy is insane at spinning a book. Oh my God, look at the speed of that. By the way, this is the world record. He spun this book for 46 minutes. He's been spinning this book for so long, everyone's so bored. <laughs> Come on, man. <laughs> Looking straight at the camera. See how he's adding energy to the book there? He's increasing the speed of the spin. So he's wiggling his finger round and round, off center, and that is what increases the spin of the book. Look how fast it's going. That's what I need to learn how to do. This book's too soft. This book's too light. This book cuts me. That's pretty good. But again, too soft. So here's what I'm gonna to switch to. The 2019 book of Guinness World Records. This is what I've seen people use in videos. This must weigh like two or three pounds. That's a lot of weight on one finger. Seems to have a nice action to it. Yeah, I think I can work with this. Longest paperclip chain, two kilometers. Most swords swallowed simultaneously. Oh, 28. People are weird. Ah, that's definitely progress. Whoa!
All right, getting pretty good at this now. But remember, the challenge is 30 continuous seconds of spinning. Let's see if we can set that today. Ah, it's about two seconds. Come on. Only 15 seconds. Come on. This is good. Ah! Ah! 20 seconds. I'm getting closer. Come on. Oh! The noise when the book drops. It's killing me. It's killing me. These are really expensive and I am destroying piles and piles of them. Come on! Oh. <laughs> I have lost all feeling in the tip of my finger and that's a good thing. I still haven't actually done a continuous 30 seconds but I think I'm gonna crack that today. Five, four, three, two, one. It's all about staying calm. Just getting a nice, continuous motion. This is good, come on. There we go. Come on. This is really good. This has got to be it. This has got to be 30 seconds. What a useless skill! <laughs> yeah. I don't even have to look at the book anymore! Look at this! I suddenly got really, really good at this. Let's roll the montage. This is a completely useless skill. But you know what's not useless? Knowing how to play guitar. I've been playing guitar now for more than 15 years. I am so happy I learned. So here's what I've done to impart my knowledge to you. I've created a course. This course is designed for the ultra beginner, someone who's never played the guitar before, and it's designed to get you playing in as short a time as possible. The course will teach you five chords from scratch and two songs, and this will provide a really solid foundation for learning guitar further and start you on your guitar journey. It's hosted on Skillshare, which is an online learning community with over 20,000 classes in whatever you like. Want to know how to use a camera? There's a class on that. How about Illustrator? They've got that covered. How about improving your presentation skills? Skillshare has a class on that as well. Since Skillshare are sponsors of this show, they're offering my viewers two months of Skillshare Premium for free. That's two months of unlimited access to over 20,000 classes delivered by the professionals. That's easily enough time to learn my guitar course and loads more. So check it out. The link is in the description. And thank you very much for watching. Now what's